What up guys, this is, uh, this is Hayden signing into the YouTube Pokemon Battling Federation to upload my first challenge battle that I had versus Life Furious. And it was a pretty good battle. Um, he leads off with his Pluto, which is a Scarfed Metacham. I lead off with my uh, Eradicate, and I'm going to switch out. He, I know he's going to predict a switch, so he's going to use something that... He's going to use a Psychic move, so... Uh, my Registeel worked out perfect. So I know he's going to switch out here. I'm going to Toxic. No, I'm not going to Toxic yet. I'm going to Amnesia, because I know he's going to go into something that's special attacking. So yeah, now I have plus two special defense on this beast. Now I'm going to Toxic his uh, Spiritomb. So that'll hurt it a little bit. His will o -Wisp misses, which is a bummer. He switches out into his Scarf Metacham again so we can get a different move up. I'm going to start setting up some more iron defenses. He high jump kicks me. That does quite a bit considering I have a plus two defense. I'm just going to seismic toss that thing to death. I thought I could take at least three, uh, three high jump kicks, but... I guess I can't. It's a good thing he didn't uh, keep going and crash for him. I just seismic toss it some more. Just to, you know, I thought I could take this next one. I like uh, calculated it and everything, but I guess not good enough because I died. So yeah, that was a bummer. My red steel got killed early, and I know that thing's scarf, so I'm gonna go on my Miss Magius because the high jump kick doesn't affect me. So I'm gonna set up a sub, and then I'm gonna start commanding. All right. So uh, his spear team is gonna start getting hurt by boys, and as I'm gonna be setting up my calm mines and and everything. And as you see at the end, this battle like fucked me up. I got fucked up because of an item. I would have won, but yeah, you'll see. All right. So these shadow balls to break my sub, and I figured I could take one without a sub. Pretty good. So I'm just gonna calm mine again. I think. No, fuck, I don't remember. I shadow ball it. It doesn't do that much. He dark pulses. I know I could take that easily. Because I have calm mines and stuff. Nothing doesn't have the best special attack. So, he gets some leftovers. He's getting hurt by poison. I'm just going to calm mine one more time because I know I could take the next movie throws at me. So... Yeah, he dark pulses. It doesn't do any. It doesn't do much. Leaves me the yellow. Now I know that the next move I go and I'm gonna use is gonna kill him. So I'm just gonna T bolt in case he switched or something. I don't know why he'd switch, but whatever. I just felt like clicking T bolt. So uh, that's the spirit him down. Now he goes back into his plateau and he's scarfed, and he's gonna be faster than me. So I switch out and in my dick pinch to take his thunder punch which I do quite nicely I could take two of them meaning I could still kill that thing off because I can take another one so yeah earthquake takes it down so that's no more scarf fast ass meta I have to worry about right, so now he goes into spaghetti and it's a really good move on his part because this encounters pretty much the rest of my team he sleep powders my uh drug dealer which is a bust for me so now he's gonna switch out and I thought he's gonna start setting up subs and calm mines like my jinx does so I was like freaking out I was like fuck I need something to do but he just goes straight for the psychic with his jinx and that does a lot to my thing now here I knew he was gonna switch to uh, Tangroth and I knew he would think I'd use ice punch so he would stay in but I guess he didn't. I should have just went for the ice punch just to be safe, but what are you gonna do? So now I go back into drug dealer predicting like a leech seed or some bullshit. He amnesia to raise his special defense by like a bunch. And now he switches right back out into his dolly. I know I can take a psychic or an ice beam pretty well from that thing. Because I'm a special wall. But I don't think I take this one very well. Yeah, that one kills me. Because he got a crit. So yeah, that crit was a bummer. That thing's life orb too, so it probably would have done a lot anyways. So now I'm going to have my horde just to sub just to see what he's going to try to do to me. The psychic, I thought he would switch. Knowing that I could just shadow ball him and kill him. But, whatever. So I just shadow ball that thing and it, it dies. 
So that's a dolly down. I get some leftovers. I'm like, have, I'm like pretty much dead. So if, yeah, I'm just gonna shadow ball this thing because I know it doesn't have the best special defenses, and I have pretty good special defense, I guess you could say. So that shadow ball doesn't do that much, and he just enter balls, energy balls me to kill me. He gets some leftovers. That thing's like a freaking pube monster. I got on my Azumarill thing. Yeah, I could outspeed it, but it just outspeeds me, and I thought, oh, I might, I might live that, but I didn't. So that was a failed part on my part so yeah now all I have left is dick pinch and eradicate so I go into my dick pinch use the X scissor that takes it out choice bandage stab adamant max attack yeah so now he goes into this thing and I'm like well, fuck if this thing has a focus sash I'm completely screwed like I lose the game if this thing has a focus sash so still thinking I have a chance I go into my eradicate, protect to get my flame orb. His last Pokemon was Chansey, so I know I could take that thing out with a, a facade. So I facade this, and I'm like pissing my pants. I'm like, if the thing has a focus sash, I lost. And guess what? It has a focus sash. Of course. So yeah, he close combats me and kills me, and that's the game. He wins. So uh, good luck in the next round. Uh, you'll probably have to battle either Xenon, uh, Revolution regional champ or behold so uh see you later